in the topic simultaneous linear equations we have already learned to solve simultaneous linear equations by using graphical method now we have other two methods elimination method and substitution method now we have a question using elimination method to solve simultaneous equations to solve means after solving we'll find the values of x and y now we we'll use elimination method elimination method means either will eliminate the uh, x variable first or the variable y in this way we will get the values of x and y step by step so if we want to eliminate the variable x first then we will multiply uh, we will make the coefficients of x same so in this way we will have to multiply equation 1 with 3 to make it 21 and equation 2 with 7 to make it 21 if we want to eliminate the variable y first, then we'll have only to multiply the equation 1 with 2. So I'm going to here multiply equation 1 with 2 in this way. I'll have 14x minus 4y is equal to 34 because this 2 will multiply all uh, the whole equation, all these values. Now equation 1 becomes equation 3. To eliminate y, we'll add these two equations, equation 2 and equation 3 in this way. So, in, in addition, the variable y will be cancelled. So, we'll get 17x is equals to 51. So, after divide, uh, 51 with 17, we'll have the value of x, 3. So, x is equals to 3. Now, we'll find the value of y. For this, we can put this value of x is equal to 3 in equation 1, 2, or 3. So I have chosen equation 1 over here, that is this one. So we'll put the value of x in this equation to get the value of y. 7 multiplied 3 is 21. Now we'll move constant value to the constant. 21 is positive here. On the other side of the equality, it will be negative and minus 2y will be equals to minus 4. To isolate y, we'll divide minus 2 on the other side of the equality and we'll have y is equals to 2. So we have a solution set 3, 2. It means the value of x is 3 and the value of y is 2. Solve these simultaneous equations by substitution method. For the question number 2, I have taken the same question. For substitution method, we can take one of these equations and make subject one of the variable. For this, I am taking equation 1. So, to make x subject, I will take equation 1 in this way. I will make, I uh, will move other values on the other side of the equality. So 7x will be equals to 17 plus 2y. And to isolate x, I'll divide 7 over there. So I have set this equation 3. As equation 3 is from equation 1. So I'll substitute this value of x in equation 2. So 3 into 17 plus 2y over 7 will be equals to this one. And we can see that 3 does not cancel 7. So 3 will multiply with these two values. This is 51 plus 6y over 7 plus 4y is equals to 17. The next step will be taking LCM. As whenever there is a fraction in the question, then we'll take the LCM. So by sol to, use, uh, to solve these two, we'll take the LCM 7. As 4y is not in fraction form, so the LCM 7 will directly multiply with the 4. Now we'll add these two values, 28 plus 6y will be 34. And 7 is dividing over here, on the other side of the equality, it will multiply. So we have 51 plus 34 is equals to 119. To find the value of y, first we'll move constant with the const to the constant. So 34y will be equals to 68. So late y will divide 34 on the other side of the equality. We'll get y is equals to 2. 
Now to find the value of x, we'll put this value of y in equation one of the three equations. One and we can put in equation one or two or three. So I have chosen equation three to put the value of y to get the value of x. So this is equation three. I'm going to put the value of y in equation three. We have 17 plus 4 over 7 and 21 over 7 is equals to 3. So the value of x is 3. Hence we have a solution set 3 and 2. Here is your home task. Use elimination method and substitution method to solve the following pairs of simultaneous equations. You are given these four equations and Step by step, you will use both methods to solve each equation. Thank you very much.